College of St. Mary's Alumni Achievement Awards are an annual tradition that honor women who embody the university's values in an exemplary way. The 2021 honorees represent the honored classes from 1961 through 2011. They are women from all walks of life who personify excellence, service, dignity, compassion, inclusivity, and integrity. Representing the class of 1961 is Catherine Reardon Carr. After attending College of St. Mary, Kathy dedicated her life to service through music. An accomplished pianist, Kathy taught piano and was the accompanist for many celebrations and services as organist and musician for her parish. As a businesswoman, Kathy owned and operated the Diet Center in Lincoln, Nebraska for 12 years. Her business was named Diet Center of the Year in 1985. Kathy's volunteerism has impacted the McCook Hospital Board, St. Vincent de Paul Society, the Food Bank of Lincoln, and many other organizations. She is married to Michael Carr and has four children, 10 grandchildren, and five great-grandchildren. Kathy recalls as a student, I was influenced by the Sisters of Mercy and the women who attended CSM. They strengthened my faith and broadened my horizons. Patricia Bianchi Bausch, class of 1966, says the highlight of her life includes the gift of being a wife, mother, grandmother, and great-grandmother. Patricia says, I have been honored to work for and serve children, and I have had the privilege of serving as a spiritual director and companion of others. Pat and her husband Jim have three children, 11 grandchildren, and one great-grandchild. Her community service extends to the Jesuit Academy of Omaha Partners Board, Lincoln Diocesan Board, Creighton University Parent Council, Lincoln Cathedral Art Show and Sale, Lincoln Lancaster County Child Guidance Board of Directors, Blessed Sacrament Grade School, and other Catholic ministries. An elementary education major at CSM, Pat credits the university with providing a spiritual and intellectual foundation. Sister Mary McTilde Hill was a brilliant professor of science with uncommon common sense and tremendous wisdom. Pat states, Sister McTilde was a strong, kind woman who exemplified to me what a woman should be. College of St. Mary recognizes all women of the class of 1971 with this year's Alumni Achievement Award. Over the last five decades, these women have shaped their communities in countless ways. They are daughters, sisters, wives, mothers, grandmothers, aunts, partners, and friends. Their commitment to service extends well beyond their neighborhoods and towns. One woman is a 35-gallon Red Cross donor. Another received a Governor's Art Award for her contributions to Mexican, Latino, folk, and indigenous art and culture across Nebraska. Several are medical technologists, nurses, and teachers. They are active in their church communities, local, regional, and national nonprofit organizations, their families, and so much more. After graduating in 1976 with a bachelor's degree in recreational therapy, Marsha Shadel Cusick went on to enjoy a 40-year career working with undergraduate and graduate students. Her positions included adult student advisor at CSM, chaplain at Creighton Medical School, and the first student wellness advocate at University of Nebraska Medical Center. She also earned master's degrees from the University of Iowa and Creighton University. Marsha's volunteer services include Mercy High School and Creighton Prep Parent Boards, president of her neighborhood association, and the CSM Alumni Board. Marsha is also a Mercy Associate, is active in her parish, and is helping to launch CSM's new alumni mentoring program. When asked how College of St. Mary influenced her life, Marsha said, College of St. Mary instilled in me confidence, pride, joy, and lifelong friendships. The Sisters of Mercy gave me the freedom and confidence to think on my own two feet, to learn from others, to ask the question, why, to speak up, to expect the best from others, and to be a leader. After graduating in 1981 with a degree in medical technology, Kathleen Neschleb embarked on a career in healthcare. Currently, Kathy is compliance coordinator for CHI Health Laboratories in Omaha. Her volunteerism includes St. Vincent de Paul Society, St. Mary Magdalene Chapter, and Christians Encounter Christ. Kathy credits CSM with providing her with a positive outlook on life, bringing faith, knowledge, courage, and strength together for her. Numerous faculty and staff impacted Kathy's student experience, including Diane Prue, then Dean of Students. 
Kathy recalled, Diane helped us look at everything in a faith-filled and practical sense and believed that every student could succeed. As a 1986 business administration major, Kathleen Kersey is an accountant in the Omaha area and earned her MBA from University of Nebraska, Omaha in 1995. Kathy is a Mercy Associate and is active in Catholic Daughters of the Americas. She is also a loyal volunteer for Billy McGuigan and Ravon Productions. When asked about CSM's influence on her life, Kathy said, CSM was a welcoming environment which allowed me to grow and become a better person. The college was my first introduction to the Sisters of Mercy, and I am so glad that I attended the college and was introduced to the Mercy Way. As a Mercy Associate, I work with the Sisters of Mercy to carry out the charism of mercy. This has made me even more committed to helping educate women. To quote Catherine McCauley, foundress of the Sisters of Mercy, no work is more productive of good to society than the careful education of women. As a student, Kathy received scholarships that helped with tuition. Education was very important to her parents, even though they never had the opportunity to attend college. To honor them, Kathy, along with her sister and brother, established the Kersey Geyser Endowed Scholarship to help other CSM students obtain their education. Amy Hefty Sokol graduated in 1991 with a degree in early childhood and elementary education. Since that time, she has earned a master's degree in curriculum and instruction from Doan College and a principalship certificate from University of Nebraska Kearney. She was named Gerhold Teacher of the Year in 2000 and an Archdiocese Rural Teacher of the Year for 2016. Currently, Amy is Principal of St. Anthony Catholic School in Columbus, Nebraska. Amy and her husband, Doug, have two children. When reflecting on her CSM education, Amy said, College of St. Mary provided me with a top-notch education and gave me the opportunity to excel both academically and in extracurricular activities. CSM challenged me to be the best that I could be by having high expectations and pushing me beyond what I thought were my limits. Dr. Joanne Carlson had so much knowledge and experience, and she shared that with all of her education majors. She pushed us to think outside the box, and when we were frustrated, she pushed us harder. Her expectations were high, and you worked hard to make her proud. The leadership roles I had while on campus taught me valuable skills and gave me confidence that I could be a positive leader and make a difference. Angela Walker Weber graduated in 1996 with a degree in business administration. She earned her MBA from Creighton University School of Business in 1997 and a JD from Creighton University School of Law in 2002. Today, she is partner and owner at Walker & Walker Attorneys at Law PLC in Prescott, Arizona. She and her husband Chip have two children. As a member of the Prescott community, Angela is active in the Yavapai College Foundation, the Arizona Community Foundation, the Salvation Army, United Way, Big Brothers Big Sisters, the YMCA, and the Humane Society. She received the Honorable Jack L. Ogg Award from the Yavapai County Bar Association in 2009. Angela reflects, quote, my CSM experience enabled me to comfortably voice my input or opinions among a wide variety of professionals and others. CSM also encouraged me to continue my education and earn two graduate degrees. Candace Novak graduated from College of St. Mary in 2001 with a degree in paralegal studies. She received her JD from Creighton University School of Law in 2004. Candace and her husband, Ted, have two children. Candace is a tireless advocate for children. In addition to her law practice, Candace has served the National Association of Council for Children, St. Joan of Arc School, and many other Omaha community organizations. She has also provided foster care education training for the St. Francis Ministries, Child Saving Institute, and Boys Town. Candace is a member of the Nebraska Bar Association, American Bar Association, and National Council of Juvenile and Family Court Judges. Earlier this year, Candace was named judge of the separate juvenile court of Douglas County. When asked about the people who impacted her as a CSM student, Candace said, many individuals and instructors at CSM were influential, but I would have to say that Dr. Marianne Stevens was the most influential. Her confidence and calm demeanor, coupled with her presence at the school and availability to students, led me to have more confidence in myself as a young woman. 
Dr. Twee Tran Cole graduated from College of St. Mary in 2006 with a degree in biology. In 2011, she graduated from Creighton University Medical School. In 2014, she completed an internal medicine residency at Creighton, and in 2016, a fellowship in geriatrics at University of Nebraska Medical Center. Currently, Twee is a board-certified internal medicine physician, practicing geriatric medicine at Home Instead Center for Successful Aging at UNMC Omaha. She and her husband, David, have five children. Twee leads one of the few transplant optimization programs in the U.S. for older adults. Nationally, she is helping to build a geriatric oncology research infrastructure through a Cancer and Aging Research Group infrastructure grant. She is a member of the Junior Advisory Board and a junior faculty leader on the Aging Measures Corps. Among other accomplishments, she received a National Institute of Health grant for early medical surgical specialists transition to aging research. When asked about her experience at CSM, Twee said, my CSM experience fostered my passion for caring for the underserved in my community in all aspects of my life, including my work as a researcher and clinician. Sister Rosemary Ara graduated in 2011 with a degree in theology education and business information systems. She also holds master's degrees in special education and educational leadership, both from University of Nebraska Omaha. In January 2022, Sister Rosemary will celebrate 25 years as a religious sister in the Congregation of the Handmaids of the Holy Child Jesus. She currently serves as principal of Queen of the Rosary College, the first girls secondary school in Cameroon. Sister Rosemary is dedicated to increasing literacy for women and girls in Africa. In 2013, she co-founded Reading Drive for Africa, a nonprofit that works to improve literacy across Central and Western Africa by providing access to books through school libraries. As a student at CSM, Sister Rosemary says she received, quote, a great foundation for my professional and academic life. The spirit of service I acquired at CSM is still with me today as I am engaged in my community and volunteer my time to serve people, especially women, children, the vulnerable, and orphans. CSM nurtured my commitment to educate the girl child, and I carry that out today with ease, thanks to my training and education at CSM. Congratulations to the 2021 College of St. Mary Alumni Achievement Awardees. We are proud of your many accomplishments and contributions to CSM and the world.